What's up, everybody? Welcome to a new English bit. I'm Katya. Today, we're going to learn 11 synonyms for the adjective important. I believe they can stand you in good stead both for your speaking and writing exams, as we use the adjective important a lot. So let's add flavor and color to our English. Are you ready? If so, grab a pen and your vocabulary notebook. This is my new notebook. And let's get going. In your English exam, you're likely to touch on different topics, such as social media, consumerism, or environment. Today, all my sample sentences we have to do with the Russian invasion of Ukraine. Ukraine is on my mind every single day and I can't overlook this injustice and atrocity. If you want to know why it matters to me so much, you can check out my previous lesson where I talk about this issue. You can find the card right here and also a link down below. And now let's get started. The first adjective on my list today that you can use to replace important is critical. Let's put it into a simple sentence. It's critical to join forces in order to stop the aggressor. And here we've got a verb that I think can be super useful for your exams. To join forces. It means to act with someone else in order to do something. Number two, the adjective essential. For example, it's essential to close the airspace over Ukraine in order to save people's lives. Let's move on to the third adjective, vital. For example, it's vital to keep imposing strict sanctions on Russia every single day. I'm so grateful that the United States decided to ban Russian oil and of course I'm thankful to see how many countries and companies stand with Ukraine all around the world. Thank you. Number four, fundamental. For example, it's fundamental to open and respect humanitarian corridors in order to evacuate civilians. Number five, crucial. For example, it's crucial to welcome and help refugees. And guys, before we continue, please, if you like today's lesson, don't forget to hit the like button and to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done it yet. Thank you very much. And now let's continue with the lesson number six, paramount. For example, it's paramount to put an end to this atrocity and madness as soon as possible. We can also say of paramount importance. For example, it's of paramount importance to be loud and protest against the war. Number seven, of the utmost importance. For example, it's of the utmost importance not to turn a blind eye. To turn a blind eye is a C1 idiom and it's a synonym of the verb to overlook. I have a lesson on this idiom. It's one of the first videos on my channel. If you're curious, you can check it out. You can find the same here, a card and also a link down below. Number eight, we can also say key. For example, it's key to fight for freedom of speech and other human rights. And I also want to say that I deeply admire all those courageous and bold Russian people who rise up against the Putin regime, like Alexei Navalny, for instance. Number nine, urgent. For example, it's urgent to help Ukrainians in their fight for freedom. I am a strong advocate of freedom. Two more to go, number 10, pivotal. For example, it's pivotal 
that above all we remain human. And last but not least, number 11, imperative. And the last sample sentence for today, it's imperative that NATO continue to send support to Ukraine. And now let's recap and go over all the adjectives that we've learned today. So we've got critical, essential, vital, fundamental, crucial, paramount, or of paramount importance, of the utmost importance, key, also urgent, pivotal, and imperative. And guys, if you know more synonyms for the adjective important, which I haven't mentioned in today's video, please let me know in the comments down below. And guys, if you enjoyed today's lesson and learned something new and useful, please don't forget to give this lesson a huge thumbs up, to subscribe to English Bits, and to remember that you can catch me on Instagram, where I teach English every single day. And of course, I want to send a lot of love and support to my Ukrainian family, friends, and all Ukrainians. We stand with you. Slava Ukraini, Geroyam Slava. And thank you for watching this video and see you as usual next Wednesday and then next Sunday. Have a nice day. Ciao!